Hey guys, what's going on? It's Delconic here, and just a quick public service announcement. Uh, before I go over all the Reddit posts that I had found, I uh, just want to state, if you guys are having problems with your teams not having any of the key or attack buff from the Super Saiyan 4s, please remember that you need to have all your cards Z Awakened before they will take effect. Remember that Vegeta and Goku, the Super Saiyan 4 variants, that you need to have super types. Super types get the most benefit out of it. Extreme types don't. They get key plus one, HP attack and defense, I believe, plus 50%. The super types are the ones that actually get the big buffs, and you need to have them Z Awakened. If you don't have them Z Awakened, they're not going to get the buffs. All right, now with that being said, let's go ahead and talk about the, the different public service announcements on the state. Um, today, stages 11 and 12 of the Tale of the Super Warriors are out. This is the one where when you grind each level, you get one medal for the two-year anniversary that you can go into the Baba Shop and purchase items. Um, you get number 11, the other Super Saiyan, and number 12, Awaken as a Super Saiyan. So, real quick, I just want to go over it. I have my Google Doc back up over here, as you guys are probably looking at. There are a whole bunch of different items you can get. Now, I don't recommend Hourglasses, maybe an Elder Kai if you pulled Super Saiyan 4 or an LR Gohan, well, Super Saiyan 4 if you guys uh, don't have enough Elder Kais or if you guys didn't pull on the Elder Kai banner or whatever the case may be. If you need an Elder Kai, this is where you would want to get it. Um, 25 coins it cost. But I just want to tell you guys about one more time all the different cards that we have over here that you can use, technically, all these guys. So, the Tech Goku Youth, he's, I mean last priority, lowest priority in my opinion, one of the lowest priorities, because you could increase the super attack of any of the Goku youth cards that you have. Um, the ones that stick out in mind are the, the strength one that was available from the Dragon Ball summons. Uh, I think there was one other one, but they're technically farmable from the event, the Arale event, so if you guys didn't hit that, it should be coming back at least one more time, so stay tuned for that, because that when that event comes out, you can grind out Goku youth cards. Uh, the next one is Strength Android 18. This one might be a little bit better. Uh, still a low priority in my opinion, just because you can get the SR variants if you're doing pulls and you get them. You can Z Awaken them, give her give it a 50% chance to raise her super deck. She's also available with Baba Gems. Now this one, this is a high priority in my opinion. If you guys, the Agility Super Saiyan Blue Goku or the Super Saiyan Kaioken Blue Co Goku, those two cards can be raised, but their super decks can be raised with the physical Super Saiyan Blue Goku card. So if you're trying to raise them, make sure that you grab these cards. It's only 10 coins as opposed to the 25 for an Elder Kai. You could increase the super attack with them. Either one of them, um, you could do. You could raise the tech one, also the physical and the strength one, um, whichever ones you want, whatever ones you have. You can increase them. I wouldn't recommend using the intelligence one for all you OG players out there. You guys should have the uh, intelligence one. I believe that was a gift to us around the time of the uh, resurrection of F event. But so, this is a high priority. The Agility Goku GT, not worth it in my opinion. Intelligence Goku, not worth it in my opinion. You technically, you could technically grind the, the rares out from the uh, Epic Battle event and just Z-Awaken them to an SR. It's only like a really low percent. I think it's like a 5% chance, but they're free. You can grind them out and feed them in and you get a percentage chance. Um, Agility Super Saiyan Goku. There are a lot of Super Saiyan Gokus in the game. So, you can use this if you want to to increase the super attack. I can't really think of any off the top of my head other than maybe the strength one for the Broly event. But even then, he has a flat out boost. Um, yeah, I don't really think there's a lot of the Super Saiyan Gokus I would actually recommend. Unless you're going for like the LR Goku. Then maybe. Maybe you can get him up to Super Attack 10 with this card. The number one priority though, I'm going to say this to you. If you guys pull the Intelligence LR Gohan, get all these Super Saiyan Gohan youth so that way you don't have to use Elder Kai's. So you awaken them to a, um, an, S, a, an Ultra Rare. I believe they don't even require an Elder Kai or Supreme Kai because they're the crappy ones. So if you Z-Awaken them, you can feed them into your base form SSR LR Gohan if you happen to get lucky and pull them, pull him, and raise a super attack. The other one is the Tech Piccolo, which you can uh, Z-Awaken into an Ultra Rare, same thing as this Gohan, and you can feed it into the LR Piccolo's base form if you have that. I just wanted to go over that just one more time so that way you guys can know, make note of the fact that you can raise super attacks of these cards, of these characters here. Um, let's go ahead and go into the other PSAs. They're not going to be as long, I promise. I'm sorry about that. Uh, if you pulled more than five Gogetas, that means if you have your base Gogeta and all four Dupas unlocked, use Elder Kai's to raise a super attack. Um, or you can you know, raise them with the other Gogetas. But if you have Super Attack 10 Gogeta, and you have all of his dupe pairs unlocked, save 
the Gogetas. Um, I'm not going to spoil a lot because I don't want to talk about the other events, the, the other summons that I did. By the way, I have um, a total of six summoning videos coming for you this week. I already released two. I have four more coming. That's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So you'll have summoning videos for me until Wednesday. I don't do those often, so I just really went hardcore because of the two-year event. Just want to let you know that I'll have something video every day until Wednesday. Um, I pulled a whole bunch of Gogetas. Now, mine's already 100% dupe systems, um, 100% up on everything, and I have about like five additional ones now. I'm waiting for the Intelligence Gogeta. I'm going to Z-Awaken all of them and then feed them into that Gogeta. Once I can feed them into that Gogeta, that, that means I save five Elder Kai so that way I don't need to use it on him. That's assuming I pull him, obviously. But so keep that in mind. If yours is at Super Attack 10 and you have all four dupe bads unlocked, keep them. Don't bother them so that way you can feed it in. Uh, thank you for X Varies X. Um, but yeah, I think that's how you pronounce your name. Or Vari, Vari, Varies. Anyway, thank you for that. Another one there's the PSA for the Great Apes from Breaking Your Rotation. Um, this one's a little bit more complicated. I might do another breakdown in this video. But essentially, when you have your Super Saiyan 4 Goku and your Super Saiyan 3 Goku, um, here, I'll, I'll keep this up so you can read it while I talk. Mute me or pause it if you want to read this. Um, thanks to Jack Cleaver for the more in-depth uh, explanation and the original post by Orange Beef, Orange X Beef. So, essentially, you have your Super Saiyan 4, then your Super Saiyan 3 Goku. If Super Saiyan 3 Goku, after he Dokken Awakens, turns into a grade 8, after the first round of him killing everyone, right? Um, essentially, the, the, that round is going to be the Cell Jun the well, in, if we can see here, after the next turn, it will be Cell Junior, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, Super GT Goku, right? Your last round of the Great Apes is essentially where the Super Saiyan 4 and Super Saiyan 3 Gokus would be if they were there. So you need to actually take the last slot and move it to the front. So you're taking the GT Super Saiyan 3 Goku and putting it there and then making sure, you know, essentially you're swapping the first and third slots um, on the second round of the Great Ape. But I'll do something a little bit more. I'll actually do an in-game gameplay video if I can make it happen for you guys to make a little bit more explanation. Um, I'll, just read this post, pause it if you need to, and just read what this says. Maybe you guys will get a better explanation out of it. I can't really explain it without showing you. Um, all right, let's go to the next one. Four times experience. May not be working. For me, it didn't. I only got double experience. So I'm going to go ahead and message Bandai about that. I didn't try today, though, after the maintenance. So um, there was maintenance yesterday. I didn't try to go into the quest because I was busy doing summons and trying to go down on the um, Super Saiyan 4 events. So if it's not working for you, make sure you email Bandai so that way they know, so that way they can, you know, they'll reimburse us for that. The other one is big success is not guaranteed in training. I had that happen multiple times when I was trying to clear out my box, raising up the super, the, my super rares so I could see awaken them. I had so many times where it did not give me a train, uh, a success in training. I was a little bit upset about that. So email Bandai about that as well if you guys are experiencing that problem. Also, apparently, I don't know how true this is. 17 hours ago, I haven't experienced this problem personally. Don't accept all the gold tickets that come in from doing the multi-summons on the special Super Saiyan 4 banners, the buy three, get one free. If you accept all, there is a chance that you will not receive all of the gold tickets. Keep that in mind, guys. Um, if you have that problem, message Bandai immediately. So essentially, all of the, like these three things, and these three things right here about the four times experience, the big success, and this, email Bandai about all three of them. Get them to fix it, because it's hurting the other players in the game, guys. And you know what? If stuff like this goes unnoticed and it doesn't get reported and the bug keeps on happening, people will drop off of the game. And when people start dropping off of the game, that means that Bandai is less likely to keep on putting out more more content for us. Because that means no one's going to be putting money in, no one's going to be playing, they're not going to be getting hints, they're not going to be getting advertisements, stuff like that. It's all marketing, I get it, I know, but we need to make sure that we you know, report bugs when we find them. Um, Alright, cool. Now we're moving over to the JP side of things. Japan, they were top grossing rewards, so JP, various items. We got seven of each turtle type shell, seven platinum shells, seven Kai planets, uh, 7,777 pop points, same amount of friend points, 777 orbs, 77 medium, seven large orbs. All types are being distributed at different times, I believe. Um, thank you for Yugi Logan. Yugi Logan. Um, so AGLs right now. I logged in last night. I was going to do it, but I was too tired. I wanted to go right over back to bed. And you get seven reversal medals. Um, that's just for being top grossing and JP. So if you're a JP player, you can go in and log in and get those awards if you haven't already done so. We also apparently have a new Napa Dokkan event coming to the the, um, uh, G, the the GT coming to the JP side. Thank you Afro Ape for that. Let's take a look. Um, this is what it looks like. We don't know any information about this. Apparently he does have super fierce battle link. That's what it's looking like. So, if that's the case, hey guys at JP, get ready for the new Napa event. 
But that's it, guys. I didn't want to make this go too long. I'm already hitting on the 10-minute uh, mark, so uh, thanks for joining me here today. Hit that sub button if you're new here. Let me know if you had any of the problems that I had mentioned in this video. Thank you, take care, and have a good day.